About one out of seven are recovered by the kicking team. Bailey puts it in play. Look at this. And it goes out of bounds. Brandon Bolden almost had it. Almost had it. He got a flag down as well. Ooh, baby. Was that interesting? A high hopper. What was interesting was that it was the blockers of the Texans that really made that play over there. It was mission accomplished on the first part, but the guys on the outside couldn't get past the blockers to recover the ball. So now you've got a conference. Terry McCauley, what are they talking about right here? It's a kick out of bounds, Al, and Houston will just decline it and take the ball where it goes out of bounds. So why does this requ require the entire crew getting together here? Is the question. Well, do they have to make sure that know. Houston <laughs> didn't touch the ball? Honestly. Houston didn't touch the ball. No, it's I know actually who touches it last, and, right, and that was certainly New England. This is a long conference, which is something that you think should be pretty simple. How about was the touch before 10 yards? Kickoff out of bounds. The penalty is declined. The ball will be placed where it went out of bounds at the 45-yard line, first down. All right. Well, we thought right from the outset, <laughs> of course. All right, here we go. You're going to end up with the blockers right here, keeping these guys from getting down the boundary and making that recovery. So it wasn't the kick part that made the difference. It was the block part, which you never think about on an onside kick, but it basically clinched the game now for Houston. Perfect hop. Bolden could not secure it. And a couple of kneels.